And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live action from the Saudi Pro League. It's Al Shabab, and they take on Al Tawun. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated and it could be difficult for them. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, the shape is the same, but they may play it in a slightly different way. And key to this game will be the fullbacks. Do they tuck in alongside their centre halves or look to support their wingers? I hope it's the latter. And this confrontation is underway. Abdullah. Al Gamdi. Kaku. Now can they make something happen? Amisi. This attack looks highly promising. Abdullah Kaku Oh, big opportunity And a goal! That will do it They've been pushing for it And now they've been rewarded Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful That's a top-class finish Back underway, 1-0 it is. Amisi. Mali prevented it from going over the line. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. An attack full of promise. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Chance here. How about the cross? Precise ball movement. Can he finish? Well, he didn't miss by an awful lot. Atan Bahebri. Al Quartani. And Jai. Banega. 
It is a decent looking attack here. Could be threatening. And can they prize them open now? Ever Banega. Surely the equaliser. And it goes! The leveller! Thrilling stuff here. Well, here's the replay. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? Just look how he goes past his marker to get his shot away. That's a really good goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. One, one. Abdullah. And good pressure high up the pitch. And the referee has pointed to the spot. A penalty it is, and a chance for them to forge ahead. This to give them the advantage. Well, it's... And the keeper denies them from the spot. <laughs> Playing it in. Ever Banega. And crossed in there. Well, he failed to get it away properly. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Can he do it to take the lead? He knew he had to make the tackle, and did. Kaku. Well, you've got to classify that as a poor attempt. A long way wide. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. al -Quartani. So, the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Banega. Njai. And now Banega. Igalo. An important interception. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, he certainly got his team back into this game with that goal. Because up to that point, they hadn't played particularly well. I think he's had a decent first half, but he'll be looking to build on his goal in the second 45. Ever Banega. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Space and time for the cross. It looks promising. To jump in front. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. As the stats show us, the visitors have had most of the play, but they aren't doing enough with it. They need to pass it quicker play forward earlier and show more energy otherwise they won't get back into this one oh fancy footwork and another one two quick goals will it turn out to be the two punch knockout well here's the replay watch how he goes past his man with such ease and it's just a change of pace and then the shot could not be hit any better struck with such venom great goal so back underway, 3-1 the score. Tawamba. It's with Kaku. This looks promising. Well read to put an end to that attack. Promising sequence. Terrific block there. Threat over for now, it seems.
20 minutes to go in this one. They've lost it. Igalo on the offensive. And let's give credit to the defending. He's got to score! Keeper did his job to begin with. What a vital intervention. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Great opportunity. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, here's the replay. And when you've got the ball at the back, you've got to pass it forward. And he doesn't do that there. He has his pocket picked and he's been rightly punished. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Abdullah. Now well, we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Kaku. Cedric Amisi. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. He's driven in the corner. No worries for the keeper. Al Quartani. Banega. Alfred Njai. Carlos and they need to get tighter crossing possibilities very alert defending to cut off the supply if you're wondering about stoppage time one minute to be added on and that is the end of the contest and not a happy outcome